Welcome to Cadillac Post Game Extra exclusively on SNY.TV. Thursday afternoon, the Diamondbacks held on to beat the Mets 3-2. to two. Robbie Ray came off the disabled list. First game after suffering a concussion on a line drive hit back at him. He struck out nine over five innings, and then the Diamondbacks held on from there. Well, Robbie Ray was really good. Uh, he said the nine strikeouts. Uh, he was overpowering, but only went five. So the bullpen for... Uh, the Arizona Diamondbacks was outstanding. I thought Rafael Montero pitched well, too. He deserved much better fate. A lot of soft hit balls uh, found their way um, and gave up the three runs that ended up making him the loser. You went assessed, but this was a big factor in this game. Home run, double, and then his last two plate appearances, he was walked intentionally, including Torrey Lavello, the Arizona manager, putting him on as the winning run in the ninth and he was in motion to try and steal second and get that winning run to second base when Wilmer Flores flied out to end the game. We're seeing more and more of these managers. The book that used to be the book is no longer the book. They're making different kind of moves late in the game. He uh, Cespedes 4 for 10 off Rodney with a home run. Uh, he, if you're watching the game at all, you could tell in this series that Cespedes is red hot, and he decided to go against Wilmer, and it worked for the Diamondbacks. Meanwhile, the thing that everybody will remember most from this game is watching Michael Conforto go down in a heap on a swing. He suffered dislocated left shoulder. 2-1 count, fastball up and in from Robbie Ray, and the follow-through produced that dislocation. It was just a horrible thing to watch, and and we're hoping for the best for Michael. The player was having a tremendous year and, um, you know, really making a name for himself to, you know, go down like that. And that, with that kind of an injury, it's, it's tough to watch. Have you ever seen anything like that before, where a guy swings and dislocates a shoulder? No. Everything's fine one second, and so we just, just go wrong just like that. Um, and it's... It's, it's just weird, you know. I mean, it was just on a swing, a normal swing. It wasn't a crazy play. It just shows how, you know, tough this game could be on our bodies. You know, see see a young guy like that get hurt in, in any situation, but certainly this guy who's, you know, again, putting his name on the, you know, in the big picture of a guy that's going to be uh, a great player here. So the Mets finish a 2-7 and seven home stand. They begin a 10-game road trip in Washington Friday night with Jacob deGrom on the mound. Our coverage begins at 6 o'clock Friday night with Cadillac first pitch on SNY. That'll do it for Cadillac Post Game Extra. Be sure to join us after every game for exclusive coverage on SNY.TV.